Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, welcome back to uh, my class, session two, English conversation. While I'm admitting each one of you in this room, I'm going to um, show you the slides directly um, where we were before. Okay, jadi kita di sini tadi ya. Um, admit all. Okay, we have number one, affectionate. Affectionate, siapa yang, mau, siapa yang tahu ini? Apa itu affectionate? What does it mean with affection? Affection, affection. It means um, that you care, that you have that uh, nice characteristic of having uh, good attention to your friends. Aggressive, apa ini aggressive? It's aggressive. Number three, cheerful. Number four, uh, we have joy, determined, ener energetic, extroverted, and we have flirtatious. Now, flirtatious ini yang suka suka menggoda ini ya. Hmm. Okay. While we are looking at this vocabulary, I'm like I'm, I would like to show you this picture. Look at this one. What are these people doing? What are they doing actually in this picture? Anyone wants to have a go? Ada yang mau mencoba menjawabnya ini? From this list of vocabulary. I think they, um, what are they doing? Siapa yang mau jawab? Anggun. You want to say something, Anggun? These people, yang di sebelah kiri bawah ini, I think that one of the one of the person in the picture is carrying a tape and he plays music, and this woman is, um, I think it's he. She's dancing. Kosa kata yang cocok apa kira-kira di sini? We find loving. Energetic. Energetic, good. Energetic, full of the energy. Cheerful, cheerful good. Cheerful. It's it means that uh, full of uh, happiness, joyful. And then what else? We extrovert. have extroverted. Yes, extrovert. What does it mean with extrovert actually? Extrovert. Extrovert means that you are happy to be surrounded with people. That is extrovert. The word is ex, extra, extra. It means out. Yeah. And then lawannya adalah introverted. Intro. Intro is something inside. Inside you. In. Introverted. And we have here um, this one. What are they doing? <laughs> They're sitting on a bench. This is called si panjang ini namanya bench. Yeah, um, on a bench. What are they doing? In here. Fun loving, sir. Fun loving, yes, it could be fun loving, and it can also mean talkative. Uh, talkative. Talkative, yes, talkative. Mm -hmm. uh, what else in here? It's, uh, I think it relates to affectionate, this one, affectionate, that they they want to express their uh, feeling, their attention, that they care to each other. That is called affectionate. Yeah. So that is the characteristic, affectionate. Perhatian uh, namanya. And what about this? This, uh, this this person who sits uh, on a bench, but uh, it seems that he is uh, lonely. What is what is moody. he doing? Uh, moody, yes. There's a moody. moody, and then introverted. Introverted, yes. Introverted, shy, shy good, shy. And can we say that that is serious? 
serious? Can we say that this person is serious? Um, he is sitting, sitting alone and he likes to see people with his dog. Um, it, I think the, the, the correct one is shy, yes. And then it is moody and then introverted. And can we say that um, this person is meditative? Meditative? Some people, you know, med meditative means uh, you do it for yourself and then you, you try to meditate. Meditate means you, you are having conversation with yourself. You are sitting in a place and then you try to observe uh, people around you and, and then you, you have that kind of internal conversation that is meditative. Um, in Islamic perspective, that might be when you pray uh, tajud, then you do the meditative, okay? That's, that's the uh, synonymous meaning with the word, meditative. All these pictures show this one, lively. Lively situation. Lively situation means uh, hidup, suasananya hidup. Okay. So remember all these words. Nanti uh, percakapannya di conversation practice to Remember, you're going to use uh, several of these words if you choose this picture, personality characteristic. Uh, that's the, uh, the assignment for conversation practice too. I remind you again, for conversation practice, ada empat percakapan, itu nilainya lebih dari nilai was. Yeah? So give the best that you, you can. All right, so that is the personality characteristics. And um, is there any word that you might not know before? Ada yang tidak tahu? Kalau withdrawn ini uh, istilah lainnya menarik diri, withdrawn. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I still remember I had, a, I had a friend when we traveled to Bukit Tinggi at the time when we were junior high school when uh, this friend came for the first time in, onto the bus, he looked so happy, he was so cheerful, but then suddenly when a few friends uh, cracked a joke to him, he felt so offended, you know, offended? Merasa singgung, ya? Offended, and then he suddenly withdrawn. Withdrawn itu misalnya mm, di dalam bus, tapi kemudian, uh, he is changing differently. That's uh, withdrawn. Tubuhnya masih di sana, tapi pikiran dan ininya sudah somewhere else, not with you any longer. And that is withdrawn. Just, uh, I don't know, you can help, but then you need to be very careful if that happens. That is personality characteristics. Um, the next one, we are going to, okay, question number two. Jadi satu sudah kita lihat. Number two, what personality characteristic do you see in each person? Now, that would be, we have discussed about this one. And question number three, what other personality characteristic can you think of? Ada nggak istilah karakter kepribadian lain yang bisa Anda tahu, yang kalian tahu di sini? Ada nggak? Selain ini. Is there any other word? Um, what about joker? Masa sebelumnya ada mister katanya, joker katanya. Oke, okay. coba joker itu kepribadiannya seperti apa? What, what is the personality look like? Joker. Uh, he, he is smiling, he is laughing, he looks so happy, but then he kill people. <laughs> what do you think? That's, uh, is that the personality? It's very interesting if you would like to be talking about that. In here, you can talk about Joker, you can talk about the superhero, um, superhero like Spider-Man. Itu namanya alter ego, ya. Alter ego, uh, something that you want people to know about you that way, but you hide the real you somewhere. That is alter ego, okay? So, uh, for example, um, you know, Batman, Batman appear like Batman, dengan Batman. But then the, the real one is without the costume. Uh, that is the different person. That is alter ego. Makanya ada di sini istilahnya withdrawn. Beda dengan moody. 
Moody is different. Moody is um, he or she can perform depending on how his or her emotion at that time. If he is happy or she is happy, then he or she can do anything well. But then when suddenly he or she is not happy, then um, they will change into something else. All right, now that is personality characteristics. And question number four, mm, which person in this scene is most like you? <laughs> That's a very interesting question. Which person in this scene is most like you? Yang seperti, which, which person? You want to answer the question? Uh, Fala, Fala Rajasa. Oh, Rafika. Mm -hmm. Which one is you? Uh, which which vocabulary that might be related to you? Dari semua kata ini, mana yang kira-kira mencerminkan, oh, ini gue nih, ini saya nih. Yang mana? Coba Rafika, which one? Moody, sir. Oh, Moody. Okay, Moody. Yeah. All right. What about uh, Sri? Sri Windiani, which, which vocabulary that might relate with you? Shy, which one? Maybe. Shy, okay. That's fine. All these words are fine. Semua kosa kata ini nggak apa-apa. Ini, ini bagus. Shy boleh. Uh, but you need to be... I was also shy. Saya juga dulu pemalu, pendiam, nggak mau ini. But then, depending on the situation, we can learn better by improving other characteristics that we have. Yeah. Jadi, um, there is something good to be shy. In other occasion, sometimes shy is not good. It's good to be talkative, but in some other time, silent is better. So it's depending on the situation. All right, now that is the personality characteristics. Thank you for your answer. And we move on to the next one. This is about friends. Okay, friend. Um, okay, this is interesting. What happened with friends, actually? Look at this picture. One, two, three. And what happened with these people? Anyone to say something? This is picture number one. Two women are talking. And then um, let's say the blue, the, the black woman, the black woman uh, show picture of his, her family. And the kids were playing something and suddenly what happened what do you call this wow mm -hmm. um, do you know any word how to illustrate this mereka sepertinya ini ngapain mereka ini berdua ini they're fighting they're fighting uh, fighting uh, quarrel the, the i think that the appropriate word to say this is quarrel Fighting itu me, me, um, lebih ke agak keras dibandingkan quarrel. Quarrel itu yang memang teenager dan adult uh, children uh, quarreling. And then suddenly the mothers intervene. Para ibu mengintervensi. Op, op. <laughs> Seperti itu ya. And uh, they try to stop. And in the third picture, what happened? Uh, they sit together. Okay, so this is this is what she's doing, and what is she doing in here? This one. What is she doing? What does she make? Membuat apa kira-kira ini? It's having or making a making a glass of tea. Okay, tea or coffee. Nah, jadi memang apa standarnya kalau kalian ke uh, American family household, teh atau kopi itu adalah dua hal yang yang sangat lumrah untuk disajikan. Uh, jarang sekali air putih. Uh, very rare, jarang. Air putih itu justru di tap, tap, tap water itu biasanya sudah bisa langsung diminum. Um, but you can request actually. 
we look at the next picture. One, two, three, four. Uh, no, it's one, two, three, and then one, two, three. So it's two series of things. Okay, look at these pictures. Mm -hmm. What happened in this series? One, two, three. Question number one. What are they doing? Kayaknya salah satunya ngapain sama mobil ini? Dia ngeliat ke mobil ini. What is he doing? Ini kuncinya katanya. Nah, this is the key. Oh, may I borrow your car? Okay. So that's the question. Hmm. And then, after the car is borrowed, what is he doing? He? Crash. He crash. <laughs> Look at this man. Look at this man. Wajahnya coba lihat itu. Uh, looks like panic or something. Yeah. And suddenly what happened? What happened? The car broke. The, the car, car broke. The car was broken or the car crashed. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's that's what happened in this. Uh, are they friends? Are they friends? These people? Mm -hmm. Apakah mereka berteman? Yes. Well, I think so. Yes, I think they so. Are. They were. And... Um, kemudian apakah mereka ini salah satunya will he lend him a car again after this is what happened I don't think so sir why why do you don't think so Lafone? well he won't trust him again mm -hmm. there is no second option right Okay, the first, uh, that's why in, in most idiomatic expressions says that trust, trust is earned. Kepercayaan itu diraih. It's not request. Kepercayaan itu tidak diminta, tapi diraih. Yeah, so that's trust. Once, once you lose the trust, forever you will be under question. <laughs> that's most uh, Western idiomatic. And I think Indonesian too. Kepercayaan itu diraih bukan diminta sekali hilang kepercayaan selamanya orang akan sulit orang akan mempercayai lagi. The next uh, picture number one, two, and three. What happened? Cry, crying. Yeah, is she's crying. And what are these people doing to her? Oh, Gossip. <laughs> okay, but look at this picture number one, okay? And we relate to the second picture. Picture number one, this woman, this yellow hair woman was crying and then she talked to her friend, okay? And this friend who listened to her crying or her stories calls someone and then she informed about that in the telephone, see? Jadi, jadi ceritanya ini curhat loh. Kemudian di, di, di telepon, this friend or this short hair woman uh, shared what this yellow hair woman told to the phone. And what happened next? The secret spread. Everybody knows on campus and they talk something bad about this yellow hair woman. Hmm, that's what happened. Okay. Now, in here, this one is called backbiting. Um, yeah, backbiting. I will type the word. It's a, a backbiting. Backbiting means when you put a knife on someone's back. Menusuk orang dari belakang. This, this is what I call backbiting. Uh, spread the gossips. And then these people would try to... I think the word, the suitable word for this is Bully, okay, you know, bullying is um, spreading the falsehood. Okay? That's that's not good. It's going to ruin someone's psychological uh, well-being. Okay, now that is very interesting uh, stories in these pictures. Look at these words about friends. We have one until twenty-four. 
um, I'd like to uh, I'd like to call or do you want to read this for us? Silakan di angkat tangannya. Please raise your hand. Who wants to read number one until eight? Nine until sixteen. Okay, Refika lagi. Titi. Um, yang lain lagi. Refika tadi sudah ya. Okay, Refika sudah. So can you turn off your raise hand so that I can see the others? Good. Titi tadi sudah. Audina lagi. Audina Niti Sesa. And then Elit Agusril. And yang ketiga siapa ini? Tadi sudah ada dua nih. Uh, okay. Um, we have um, Audina, Elit, Diti. Diti tadi sudah belum? Diti sudah ini kayaknya. Sudah, Mister. Oke, okay, yang lain lah, yang lain. Siapa? Elit, Agustil, Audina, um, Devi. Devi Aulia, oke. Okay. Karena nggak ada yang ini ya. Silakan. Hmm. Silakan. Audina Nitisesa. Tisha, best friend, Sophie, disloyal, envious, friendship, generous, insensitive, insincere. 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 Ya, yeah, insincere. Ya. Yeah. Ini yeah. insincere ini uh, maknanya tidak ikhlas. Insincere. Kalau sincere ini ikhlas. Uh, okay, the good. And um, next one, number nine until sixteen. Uh, Elite Agustril, please go ahead. Number, okay, number nine, irresponsible, jealous, kind, loyal, funny, reliable, responsible, self-centered. Uh, self-centered. Yang red yeah. ini tidak yang kata ujungnya ini yang uh, affixnya ini tidak dibunyikan uh, red tapi centered center agak lari ke dalam dia kemudian reliable bukan reliable reliable rely on reliable so this list of words now we come to the next one number 17 to 24 tadi siapa silakan Devi sir ya Devi silakan selfish sensitive sin care supportive a uh, true true friend trustworthy to face unreliable okay ini tadi yang kurang pas ini namanya sincere sincere coba sincere sincere okay si sincere sincere ini tulus tulus ikhlas sincere. namanya ya yeah. um this is dealing with friends yes, uh, okay thank you everyone who have read this list of words ada beberapa kosakata tadi ada yang uh, best friend kemudian we have carefree uh, disloyal yang negatif ini ya siapa yang tahu mana yang kosakata positif di daftar ini the first one is best friend and then carefree yeah. hmm? friendship friendship, friendship. what about generous yes generous is Uh, yeah. uh, kind, kind, loyal, loyal. Funny. Is is funny good? No. Funny, funny, funny is not good. Reliable? Yes. No. Yes. Responsible. Uh, responsible. Yes. Responsible. Uh, self. Self centered. Mm. No. 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 Self-centered means uh, you put everything just for you. That's self-centered. Berpusat pada diri anda sendiri. That's self-centered. Uh, what about selfish? No. No. no that's not good. Uh, sensitive? No. 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 Um, maybe. It depends. Jawabannya it depends. Depends on the situation. Yes. Sometimes it is good to be sensitive, but overly sensitive is not good. You know, overly sensitive means terlalu sensitif itu juga tidak baik. Karena bisa me 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 menyakiti diri sendiri juga sih. Overly sensitive. But insensitive yang ini, insensitive itu malah lebih parah. Ya, uh, tidak punya kepekaan. And supportive, is it good or bad? Yes. Good. 
Yes, Good. supportive. True friend. Mm -hmm. yes. 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 Trust trustworthy. Yes. yes. Trustworthy. Yes. Yeah. Bisa dipercaya. Yes. Two face. No. 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 <laughs> Bermuka dua. And we have unreliable. No. No, unreliable. And I'm interested with these two things. Best friend and true friend. Are they different or the same for you? Best friend and true friend. Best friend, true friend. Are they the same or are they different? What do you think? Same, same. same. The same. If they yes. are the same, why did they are not listed on the same, this one, the same list? Uh, best friend and true friend. I think they are different. Best friend, well, yeah, best friend is very close to you. Um, but then best friend in terms of what? That's the question. Best friend dalam hal apa? Kan ada kalau misalnya lagi terakhir, nah ini best friend ini. Tapi kalau laginya, kalian laginya sakit, dia menghilang. That's not best friend. Okay, so when when someone is taking advantage of you, it depends on how you call it. Is it best friend or uh, true friend? I would prefer true friend rather than best friend. True friend is someone who really pays attention about you and he or she is not afraid telling you the truth about you from what or he or she sees from you and want you to see to be the best version of yourself. That's true friend. Um, in front of you or in the back, they are still the same, respecting you. you know, that is true friend. But best friend, sometimes you categorize it the best, but in some other time that they are not the best. It's very dependable. So I, true friend is difficult to find, okay? <laughs> do you agree with me or do you have your true friend? True friend is difficult to find. What do you think? Don't find. Uh, my suggestion, don't find friend, but be a friend. You know what I mean? Don't, don't find a friend. But be a friend. Jangan cari teman, tapi jadilah seorang teman. Ya, yeah. uh, dengan menjadikan diri kita seorang teman, kita akan punya banyak teman. Am I right? Hmm, okay. And what about this one? Okay, we come to the picture discussion. Okay, kita sudah bahas tadi ini. What is a true friend? I have told you about this. Um, what kinds of friends do the other stories show? Number three, ini. Number two, ini. Picture number two. What kind of friends do you think? Yang ini. What kind of friends? Irresponsible. Good. Irresponsible friend. Okay. You, uh, this friend, borrow his car and then he carelessly drove the car and hit someone until the car was broken. That's irresponsible. And when, kalau kalian masih misalnya bilang gini, kamu harus ganti biaya perbaikannya, terus temannya bilang, oh, masa gue sih yang ganti, lu kan temen gue. What will you say? Um, you can get your friend by paying the cost by yourself. But when you say you have to be responsible, then you will lose your friend. Which option do you choose? Mm -hmm. Which option? Pilihan yang mana? Option number one, you ask responsible, but then you will lose your friend. Number two, you don't ask for responsible, but then you still get your friend. Which one? First option. Yeah, first option. Because you have to teach your friend. Okay, so it's 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 your life that you have something. You 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 you, you try to get one and then you let it be used like that. The next one, 
we will come to childhood memories. That was about friends. We have good best friend, true friend, all those kind of friends. We will come to childhood memories. Wow, this is interesting. Look at these pictures. They're dreaming about something. One, two, three, four. Mm, we have this list of vocabulary. Uh, one until 24. Anyone wants to read this? Um, siapa yang mau baca? Try. Mm, raise your hand, silakan. Well, Salsabila Anissa, you want to read this? David Lee, okay, David Lee yang kat tangan. Um, David Lee, Salsabiti tadi. Okay, siapa lagi? Ini kayak David Lee udah tadi. Hmm. Dan yang okay. pertama, Sir. Yang pertama ya, oke. Okay. Um, siapa yang mau coba? Mm -hmm. Oke, okay. time is running, waktu jalan terus kita oke. Okay. Silakan David Lee, Biti dan tadi Revika yang nggak jadi Revika yang ketiga. Ya. Silakan. Oke, okay, number one until eight, David Lee. Nine until sixteen, um, DT number seventeen to twenty-four, Revika. Oke, okay, go ahead. One adventure, two adventurous. Three curiosity, four curious, five dangerous, six experiment, seven fairy tales, eight fearless. Okay, good. Thank you, David Lee. The next one, BT. Silakan. Imaginary imagination, like or strike a match, memorable, nostalgia, nostalgic, play with dolls, play with fire. Hmm. Okay, good. Uh, Davika, 17 to 24. Fred read a lot, remember, reminisce, mm -hmm. uh, rocking chair, mm -hmm. sort fight, tea party, mm -hmm. used to. Okay, thank you, Davika. Ini tadi pretend, ya, ini pretend. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, pretend. Yes, uh, reminisced, uh, reminisced, rocking chair. Sword fight, uh, sword fight, ini dia, sword fight, ini kalau yang, I don't know about girls, but when I was young, I always like to do this with my uh, stepbrother, bukan, no, not no stepbrother, with my cousin, that's what we did, we play sword fight, uh, and then what about this one? What are they, what is she thinking about? So this is tea girls. Party. Tea party. Imagination. Imagination, yes. Uh, it is very related to tea party. Jadi kalau di most American culture, girls when they were young, they were told to to celebrate this tea party. Uh, minum, minum, minum teh, seperti ini, coffee, makan cookie, sambil talking on the table, that's for girls thing. Boys usually like to do this fighting. Tapi sekarang sudah terjadi pergeseran, apa ya, uh, value. Uh, girls juga boleh seperti ini sekarang. Juga boleh. Um, and then, girls tidak harus seperti ini. Uh, ternyata ada juga boys yang suka seperti ini. So it's a very uh, dependable situation, okay? Hmm. Uh, but don't change, okay? If you change, that's worse. Uh, you want to change to be boys, or boys want to change to be girls. That's that's very dangerous. Um, the next one we have this. What is she dreaming about? With her tears. Uh, uh, her childhood with her grandmother. Good. Perfect. Yes, she spent her childhood with her grandmother. And what did uh, her grandmother read? This one. What did her grandmother read? This one. I think it's fairy tales. Fairy tales. Yeah. Fairy tales. No, it's it's a very uh, norm. Yeah, not normalnya. Kalau in most West uh, 
tradition, they like to read these fairy tales for kids from the Disney, Cinderella, all those things. The next picture, what happened to this man? <laughs> what happened when he was a kid? Uh, this is fire. Playing fire. Good. He liked He's, to do. Mm -hmm. He liked to do. Was was he naughty? Uh, was dia he suka naughty? Ah, dia suka kebakaran. Wow. Yeah. He play with <laughs> fire, right? <laughs> yeah, he play with fire. He play with fire, and he was a naughty. Um, well, thank God that I wasn't like this when I was young. What about you? Which picture that symbolizes you when you were a kid? Which one? Kalian yang mana nih yang paling dekat gambarnya? Like Number this? two. Number two. Dian Hardini yeah. fighting. Yes, sir. Okay. Okay, fine. That's okay. Um, playing with dolls. Were you yes, like that? Playing with dolls. You like that, Diki? Yes, I did. <laughs> Diki, Arya Putra playing with dolls and tea party. Uh, which one? Or you playing with fire? Well, everyone has their own yeah. choice. So remember. Um, okay, that's childhood memories, right? Now, we would like to be seeing this one. Um, This is rocking chair. Nih, ini disebut dengan rocking chair. Si goyang, rocking chair. And then read aloud. Jadi yang dibaca oleh nenek ini ketika membaca buku untuk anaknya disebut read aloud. And we have um, this is pretend. Pretend like this. Pretend that you are the queen or you are the uh, princess. You're having this tea, ballroom, everything. And okay, that's everything is nostalgic. Jadi nostalgic ini penuh kenangan disebut nostalgic, and kenangan adalah nostalgia. So you you might relate all these things. You still remember when you were a kid, Febriani? When you do you still remember when you were a kid? Mm, I don't really remember. Uh, you don't, okay, you don't really remember. Um, that, that, that's okay. But at least when you still remember, that's one of the good things uh, when you were a kid. And sometimes, well, um, I have been teaching for 12 years as a lecturer. When I teach writing, ketika saya ngajar writing, as I writing, <coughs> excuse me, saya pernah meminta mahasiswa bercerita tentang masa-masa kecilnya. I... I read many interesting uh, childhood memories. So not all people came from good childhood memories. Sometimes came from a trauma when they were a kid, <coughs> excuse me, and many other things. But that was in the past, okay? Don't bring the past to today. Semua terjadi masa lalu, jangan bawa hari ini, ya? So you're, today is, you are happy and bring that happiness forward. Okay, um, you need to move on. All right, now this is childhood memories. We're seeing you back in session three right after this. Okay, I stop share. I'll see you again in session three. Video abis ini. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.